So what we can see is that we have the lemmas of model converter in the cloud also, which means it's also an AIMS application. So once we launch it, we see that we have two different menus, the home and the data review. And we see that we can upload the data. So we can also select whether we want to consider miles or kilometers, just like you would be able to do it in the, the SE Navigator. So for this case, let's just keep it in miles. And we can also define if we want to use uh, input data that comes from the Excel, straight line or straight line plus a wiggle percent. So what we're going to do is upload our data. So this comes out of an Excel template from Lamasoft. Here I select to upload. And um, in the back, what it's doing, it's uh, based on the mapping that we have set. It's transforming that information from the names of the attributes and the names of the sheets of Lamasoft to uh, names that we can read in AIMS. So it's just reading the data for now. And if you see, it's already populated the information that it has read. We have the map and the flows, and we can also see where the different locations are. We can also use the data review to understand what's uh, being read in each one of the customers. And we can see the red sheets. So for example, uh, the accepted sheets are colored in green. The accepted sheets, but that have a change in the name. If you see the sheet contains extra spaces, it's still going to read them, but it's going to make you aware that it's potentially has been changed from what uh, comes out of the Lamasoft SGM file. And finally, in this case, for example, we have a, a sheet that is probably used for calculations, which is a, called a sheet one, and it's colored in red, which means that this sheet has not been read. Then finally, what you can do when you see that the information is there, you can click here to download the SE Navigator template. Um, right now we're only using SE Navigator, but let's say you would want to do the same for network design. You can also export to a network design uh, template, but what we're gonna do now is just downloaded this information and transforming it into the SE Navigator template. It's already been done, so I'm just gonna save it. And I'm gonna show you what it looks like in the template of AIMS. So it's exactly the same sheets. Here already we have the different values. We have all of the type of products, including the product groupings. So all of the information that has been input from Lamasoft, uh, supplier information, all of the different um, supplier product data, if, even if it's not something that we have in our Lamasoft template, we're still going to get the empty attributes. This is so somebody, if they want to include this information later on, then they can do so. So when we have this done, uh, and after we have checked that everything is correct and all the values are there, we can directly, I'm not going to save it, we can directly open our um, SE Navigator application and upload just like you would any other uh, SEN template into the app. And of course, if there are any, any errors uh, from the data validation, then that um, is going to be picked up by uh, the SE Navigator reading function. And you can just go ahead and change uh, whatever needs to be to be able to fix the errors, or, or you can just choose to ignore the errors or warnings and then just load the template and see the results. So let's uh, try that now. So you can upload upload it. The same um, output that we got from the Lamasoft converter. So it's now retrieving all of the data sets and doing the data validation. So it's possible that we get some uh, some errors or warnings because it's not a data set that we have checked before. So in this case, we have a few errors. We can just close it, but we see that it's the same map 
that was represented in the other application. We can optimize it and it's going to be able to solve it just like you would solve it in LamaSoft, in this case, without making any modifications. But if you had to make any, you would be able already to do them in the SEN template and not necessarily go back to any LamaSoft Excel templates. <laughs>